Hello, this is the Provoke Prawn, and this is a video to show you how to use the jetpack. Now, I've done a video previously on how to get the jetpack, but that was a while back and things have changed a little bit since then. But this video is aimed at telling you how to use the jetpack more than to get it. Now, to acquire the jetpack, you can get it in a number of different ways, one of which is from the orbital fridge, the other one is from the slot machine, and the third and final way is to get it by killing enemies that happen to have it. As you can see, the jetpack stands out on the back of enemies quite badly. It's really obvious when you pick it up, it drops into one of your equipment slots and then you can use it. Now to use the jetpack, you simply need to press and hold your jump button. Sure and it is a very useful bit of kit to use. You can see me using it here to grab the heart of my fallen teammate and then jet away. You can use it to fly pretty high and a long distance across the map. However, it is very obvious and it is very loud so you people will hear and see you especially if you're near near them as you land it's also worth noting that as well as pushing and holding jump once you're in the air any movement so forward movement for example will make you carry on boosting so if you're in the air and you're already flying if you press forward you will carry on boosting even if you're not pressing and holding jump anymore so it's worth knowing that because you might find you still go you're still going when you don't mean to be a pro tip for using the jetpack is to, if you can find them, equip the bunny slippers. Those bunny slippers prevent any fall damage, so that means if you accidentally use up all your fuel while you're in the air, or are too high in the sky and then drop out of the air in a dangerous way, when you hit the ground you won't die, which is obviously an added bonus. Now the jetpack can be used to get across vast areas of map, it can also be used to get out of trouble. So if you're in a position where you're getting shot out a lot and there are a lot of enemies nearby and you want to get out of there, then you can boost to get out of here. Here you can see me using it to get out of gunfire so I can heal briefly. However, it does go wrong and I still manage to get shot. <laughs> and my t the enemy chooses to shoot at me rather than my teammate that's actually shooting at them and the result is I get downed. However, it is useful to use it in that way. As I said, you do need to pay attention to the amount of fuel you have though. It is limited, and you can see the fuel in the bottom left corner near the minimap. You got a little bar there. You can use quite a lot of fuel. There is no way to refuel it, but it does last quite a long while, especially if you fire it in tiny bursts rather than using the whole thing at once. So as I said, press and hold, jump in order to use it and boost away. And be careful how you're moving when you're boosting because that will also carry on boosting you. And then when you're coming down to earth, what you need to do is just ease yourself back down. So use little bursts of boost to get back down to the ground safely. Hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching. This has been the Provoke Prawn. Hope you found this video useful, interesting or hilarious. Be sure to subscribe and check out these other videos as well as taking a look in the description for links and Enver information you might find useful. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or anything you'd like to see extra about this. And have a great life.